Sorry about that. So, um, the importance for exercising when you have muscular dystrophy and now it's any kind of muscle dystrophy. Um, if you, I'm going to sound like a doctor for a minute, but it's so true. If you don't use the muscle, you're going to lose it, no matter if you have muscle dystrophy or not, but with muscle or dystrophy, It's harder for us once we um, don't use the muscle, we lose it a lot faster than regular people. So I learned this the hard way. Um, you know, if you watch my other videos I kind of tell you guys so I used to be able to walk um and then sorry about these beats on my finger and then so but now my feet are like my tenants and my foot um they actually got so tight that um I I'm not able, you know, like, to walk or, you know. So, for uh, you guys, I'm not trying to sound like a doctor or nothing, but if, even, you know, it doesn't matter if you have to use a walker or a Pain to help you or anything, just keep it up. And yeah, I'm not saying it's going to be easier or nothing. I'm just letting all of you know that if you can walk or <laughs> You guys can do something. Keep doing it because you know. So that's what I'm doing right now. I am. I'm trying to flip all of these beads. Um. I'm on video. So, um, anyways, um, sorry about that for young guys. So, so, um, like I was saying, like, for all, uh, if you have to use a walker, um, a cane or anything, I really suggest you guys to keep it up and try your hardest because once you're wheelchair bound and you're in a wheelchair, it is harder, um, it's actually really hard for you, well, maybe not everybody, but for me, it's hard for me because 
I miss walking. Um, like I used to get be able to get in and out of bed by myself, and now I use a toilet. I have to have someone help me get in and out of bed. Um, see, so like, for real, even if it gets really hard to do something, just keep trying. I mean, it might be really hard, you know? You might think, oh my God. You know, but if you actually believe in God and you pray, you know, just say, please God, here, I'm gonna pray real fast. Um, this is a prayer that I kind of say every, actually every day to God, you know? Um, so I'm gonna pray real fast. Everybody, please put your head down. Um, so, Heavenly Father, please, uh, you know, it's kind of hard and difficult to do different things. With my predicts ataxia, MD, muscular dystrophy, you know, please, Lord, um, can you please help me and give me the strength and the power and the energy to just help me give my strength and my ability back, please, God. In your name, Jesus Christ, thank you. Amen. That's all. Every day, just say that prayer, and God does answer people's, um, prayers. So if you ask God, if you ask Him, to help you, he will help you. I mean, he might not. You might think he's not, but really, to be I need to <laughs> so. Sorry, everybody had to get a drink. But, um, everybody, um, uh, you have to do every day. I mean, even every time you wake up in the morning, just pray to God every morning. Terms of that, and I guarantee you, um, if you believe in Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, um, okay, well. Answer your 
workers even um all you have to do is honestly all you gotta do you guys is believe and understand that he help he will help He's not there to do everything you pray to him he will help you to get your strength back but he's not there to like if he said, please, God, help me get my shape back and you don't do nothing. All you do is pray and you don't do nothing to help yourself. Well, sorry to say, but you better help yourself too. God ain't gonna just do it all for you, you know? Um, so I've learned that because, you know, I don't know, I just, um, and I learned this too in life. Um, and people said, let's say they said it's there, you know, at you for different reasons, you know, maybe. You... You have a booger on your face or something. Well, guess what? Those people that stare are let's use this for an example. Like, let's say I go and I like a brush dry and Um, I wear a bit blood, say, so I don't get food on myself, for I need someone to help me feed my blood, say, and so I'm sitting there and someone's feeding me with a marijuana. People that are there, they stare, you know, and I've learned when people stare, it's not, most of the time, they're not trying to be mean, they're, they're trying to understand, well, most people are trying to understand why um you're why you need the help, you know? Um you know, but I wish like I don't know about you but are you guys but me I would like people to walk up to me and say, Hi, um, hey, um, so 
I was wondering why you're in a wheelchair. Oh, why you need help. You know what I mean? I think that's more like, I don't know. I like that. I would like that better than someone sitting there and staring at me like, uh, you know, or like making fun of me and stuff like this. Like, um, and most of the time, when people make fun of others, um, they're jealous of that person or they don't understand why that person needs help. Um, and the younger kids that just make fun of her. Even some of our older people uh, they make fun of some, uh, some, somebody else. Um, so we just, um, I don't know. Yeah, so when people make fun of you, just kind of brush it off. Um, actually, I've had a lot of people that say, you know, mean things to me. And to be honest, I don't care what other people think or say about me because I know who I am. And I have um, someone, his name is Jesus. His name is Jesus Christ. And is my savior, and I have him on my side, so I don't care what the people say about me. Um, sometimes, I mean. There is certain things that people say, and yeah, it hurts my it hurts my feelings. But wow, that sun is really hurting my eyes right now. So, um. And there's my feelings, you know, sometimes, but we're going to have people like that, you know, but you just have to brush through it and make it, make it the best you can. You know, who cares what other people think? You know, if you're doing the right thing, uh, actually, you know, more props to you, you know? Like, so do not ever, uh, you know, like, When people look at you and start laughing and stuff, 
just, you know, talk out loud and say, but are you jealous of me? Why are you laughing at me? Why are you making fun of me? You want to be me? You know, and I just don't even say nothing. And just tell yourself, you down inside yourself. You, you know who you are. And maybe they don't know who they are yet, you know? Some people don't, and just are doing it and just impress other people, you know? That they're around or whatever. And they really don't want to hurt your feelings. You know, think it hurts. But it does. I mean, so just kind of brush it off, you know what I mean? And if they're family, say something. Don't. Do not allow them to treat you that way, you know? Um, I'm older, so, you know, um, but I do, I'm very an outspoken person. So, I would say, what are you laughing at, you know? Don't laugh at me. You know, because they don't know, you know, like, that does hurt, you know? That hurt your feelings. Words than you know if they hit you or something, you know. So I'm. All right, I am done and not that subject. That was my subject for the day. So, um, you guys are new to my channel. Please hit the subscribe down below. And if you can, please like my videos. Do you like my video? Like it? Turn on. Trying to fix this before I end my video. So, I enjoyed um, being able to sit here and talk to all of you today. Um, please, if you guys have any questions or comments, please let me know below and I will answer them. Um, that's all for today. Thank you guys. Please press the subscribe 
button below and please like my videos. Thank you.